one with strength or without strength. Uh, without strength, I mean the non fighting. That means a non resisting. Not using of the uh, muscles in order to overcome the partner. So that's what we get doing just now. Using this the principle, then you find that the other techniques was fine with it. But still, those who haven't understood, use the technique to overcome the partner there. Once you start doing that, anyone from other martial art, without understanding the true meaning of it, copies the technique and they say Aikido. So they, they, does, they do Aikido. Let's copy the movement technique and things like that from the book, from someone, uh, from an instructor who does not uh, uh, teach the relaxation. They say that's the Aikido. So any Judith person can claim they practice Aikido. Right? I'm not putting down Judith. It's different from Judith. I know a true meaning of Aikido is difficult to really understand. That's why we do Kukyu Dosa. That's the basis of all the uh, relaxation movement there. So please, if I stand into this position here, on a position here, right? I get close to my partner here, still without using force. If you understood this, wow, that's beautiful. You really feel that you have understood that. So you constantly, every day, you practice something like that. Right from here now, let's. I go and do this on here. At this moment, partner pose. Yeah, like, like so. Right, so I go and do this on here. Right? Because just here, we understand this one. Without understanding that, it won't be true Aikido. But of course, I'm still beginning of true Aikido. So therefore, if we all practice the Irimi technique from here, into this, like this here, right? from here, tenka movement like this here, we understand that. Just moving our body without fighting a partner here, meeting a partner's force, yet without fighting, without resisting a partner's force. I think that's a, a good feeling. How about that, please? Thank you.